stone wall. The trail sort of hugs along the edge of it. And heads this way. Here we're following a stone wall line. Some odd old kit here. Fairly square. Come to the turn here. Work our way back toward the pond. And this is recent damage from probably Sandy or the Nor'easter. And it distracts you from noticing the trail run. We're nearly at the on in the parking lot. Now, this is a really old blow down there, just left as a kind of ornamental, evidently. Kind of charming. A little obstacle feature. direction. You can hear the drone of some motor thing in the distance and the cars near and by. This is the key turn where you start to go to the edge of the old pond namesake of the place with its dam and its colorful historic relics. All in all, this is a very satisfying part of the Bay Circuit in Kingston. This area is sort of overgrown with brambles, so you'll want to be alert. And we should be down by the ponds in no time. And run on the hall there. And the home stretch. Something we generally refer to as out of here. The parking lot looms. Interesting smaller boulder strew in keeping with this area's rocky upland character. Here's another blowdown from Sandy. Or some such thing. There's the pond. It's rather bucolic. kind of southeastern Massachusetts bucolia. Oh, look at that wolf tree, good lord. Lots of huge ancient white oak wolf trees here. And we're home stretching it past the 
big old hemlock. There's another giant white oak. Kind of the pine trees have grown old and huge from amongst the white oak trees that were somehow allowed to remain. The oak trees are probably date back to colonial times. The pines probably post-Civil War, early 20th century, I would guess. And here's the charming old pond. Yeah. An impoundment. Here's some more blowdown damage. This was the one I think that initially <coughs> almost deterred us but we decided to be intrepid and press on. Brambles be damned. Some more younger white oak. Turn indication brings you along an old part of Dam Berm and beckons to the parking lot once you traverse another bit of recent storm damage. Just like that. And as you can see, the stunning Yankee Pond here in the midst of November. Your classic quaint little footbridgey thing in all of its glory. And the stream hurtling on towards Taunton, most likely, to unite with the waters of the Taunton River. Made rock lined water course. The Commonwealth and all its charm. And there's an old 
grinding store for corn from the earliest uses of Mulberry Brook, which is what this is. It's been bothered by Euro mud humans since at least 1742. It was the site of sawmills, forge hammers, a cider mill, and from 1752 onwards, iron foundries, including manufacturers of Revolutionary War era cannonballs. This is our parking lot. And there it is in all its charm. Old Pond. 